I think like all MPs, I've spoken to people in my constituency who have struggled to get through a month. Maybe they've had a domestic crisis like a boiler breaking, who've needed short-term credit, but who haven't been able to get it from banks or from other institutions. They turned to desperation to pay their lenders, maybe borrowed a hundred, a couple of hundred pounds, and then been unable to repay and finding those debts just mounting and mounting and being very scared by the situation that they get themselves in. So we need to follow the example of other countries, take tough regulation, understand that people need access to short-term credit, make sure that they aren't being ripped off in the process. Well, we've got a unique opportunity uh, over the next few weeks with the consultation around the Financial Conduct Authority proposals about payday lending to shape this sector, uh, to undo the damage that's being done and to put in regulations which will protect people from the exorbitant interest charges, the punitive penalty charges and the unscrupulous practices which have taken people from small loans into spiraling and unmanageable debt uh, and it's important to understand that everybody has an opportunity to bring about change. It's not just for those of us who are politicians. We need a public involved, we need churches taking action to highlight the problem, to show that it can be different and to force the government to change.